This is my E-Barb spam deck. I'm gonna get to 9,000 trophies with this. I am so close. Big mistake, big mistake. Spam, E-Barbs. Yeah, you thought. That's what my deck's supposed to do. And it doesn't work. I screwed up on that one part. Jeez. Gosh, this it sucks. I wanna get out of here. Big mistake on his part. Oh! Wait, does he have Night Witch? Oh, shoot, if he has Night Witch... Here's why I want to get 9,000 trophies. You don't drop trophies anymore if you get up there. It's really just like a playground because you, like, test your levels in comparison to other people. You can also, like, have double evolutions all the time, every time. It also looks nice on your profile. Like, if friends or people in your clan look at your profile, they'll see, oh, you're at 9,000 trophies. You must be good at this game or something like that. I'm not good at this game. I just pulled out the credit card. I could do a risky move. Holy crap, put, why'd you push it? Why did you push that out of the way? Okay, bad mistake. Most of these games I lose because I try to do something stupid and die. All right, he made a big elixir commitment. He put golem pocket, like holy crap. Big elixir commitment, and he's dead because of it. Holy crap, I am so good at this game. Nah, he thought, he's not doing it. He's not doing it again. Goblin barrel, who's that? Jeez. Jeez. Why did you go for the night, for the love of, oh my. I actually think it's easier to play on my phone. I wanna get the, the large screen experience for y'all. He screwed up. However, I'm about to screw up because, you know, it's Mega Knight. Who at Supercell decided to nerf Cannoneer? I mean, I'm not a Cannoneer user, but of all the cards. It says, where did he get the stupid Magic Archer from? Done. Actually done. Get out of my game. I'm back to winning and losing, winning and losing, winning and losing, winning and losing. That's what this arena is like. Jeez. Wait, is this going to be like the same guy from... Jeez. Yeah, it is. You mistimed the graveyard. Why does graveyard work so well? I don't, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready to be done with this graveyard stuff. Oh my gosh. So freaking close. Oh my gosh. I can't break through, but it's fine. I have the damage advantage. He missed the Valkyrie. Yeah, it's, it, you're done for. At least we get a lucky drop. That is great. All right, we, we have both of our King Towers that are turned on. Oh, Magic Archer connection. You love to see it. You love to see it. All right, spam, spam, spam. My deck is literally just spam. He's gonna place Hog. I already know. Already good damage. There you go. There you go. Oh my gosh. Finally made a breakthrough from this win, loss, win, loss, win, loss loop. I'm going to make it to 9,000 trophies. That is a given. This kid actually thought that E Golem would work against me. Oh my gosh, this kid actually had the thought process. Maybe this guy struggles against Eagle. I do sometimes. Not when it's played this badly. I'm winning. I'm winning. I'm gonna get to 9,000. I'm not I'm not gonna do it in this video probably, but I'm gonna get to 9,000. But I need to break through somehow. I won. I have the damage advantage. I won. I need to get to 8750. That's what I'm gonna do today. Oh shoot, fireball again? Wait, this is 2.6. He's not playing this deck right. This isn't 2.6, this is a modified 2.6. I guess I can just keep the damage advantage. This is why I play Squad Busters. What is bro doing? Hold up. What is bro doing? Wait. I win! I'm not doing this anymore, I swear. 